Hello, everybody. As we all know, Big Brother Ninja Season 9 starts on Sunday, 28 July 2024. So it's that time of the year for all the madness, the fun, the fan love, the favorite defending, and the inescapable trolling. Yeah. So many viewers have been watching this reality show for years now. And from their comments, I realized that there are so many, so, so many saying wise, realistic, fair, and peaceful BB Ninja viewers. Everyone is not a troll. So I bring you comments from some wise and intelligent BB Ninja viewers from my coin, BB Ninja Truth and Wisdom Corner. Here we go. So at Ebele Okoli, 5697 says, having an open mind will definitely help a lot of viewers because some people think that one has to see things the way they see things. Trying to accommodate others' point of view is very necessary to be able to watch the show and enjoy without being toxic. And she's right on point. You do not have to be toxic to make others respect your opinion. And she goes further to say, yes, the show is a competitive show, so I get confused when some viewers attack housemates that are very competitive, as if that is not what all of them are supposed to be doing. The housemates are supposed to be competitive with each other in a competition to win a big prize and order tax prizes. Exactly. I mean, what is the purpose of going to the house if you're not going to be competitive? You're not going to the house to laze around. You're supposed to compete for the money. Then, Ebele Okoli concludes her opinions with, the trolling part is ridiculous. Even after so many years of Big Brother season, one will see viewers that troll these housemates even after the show has finished some years ago. Forgetting that people grow Forgetting that people grow and change. Viewers need to stop that trolling on these housemates. They are also human like them. Wow, that, that's an amazing comment. You know, tro trolling is carried out only by ugly people that are frustrated with their own lives. So they will say or do anything to upset others. I mean, we all should try and develop thick skins. I know that that, that is easier said than done. Okay, let's go on. So at Happy Mail 2114 says, this internet street is about to get real wild and crazy. That's so true, I know. <laughs> I hope it doesn't get worse than it already is. Please, personally, I'm not breaking a leg this season. Good for you. I'm just here to enjoy the show in its entirety. I mean, that is the key. Just enjoy the show. You do not need to fight or troll anyone. So let's go on. At Essek Wansima 901 says, I'm telling you, we should try, we should really protect our sanity because it's about to go down. Yeah, we can, I can't wait. Then Beam 7580 says, Watching BBN over the years taught me how to put my emotions under control in my everyday life. Standing Angel in 2021 and later in 2023 really taught me to respect people's feelings and perspectives, even though it might hurt that it doesn't align with mine. Wow, what good reasoning, Beams. I mean, just because people are of different opinions about, you know, a particular housemate doesn't mean that you have to start fighting everybody online. I mean, it's only crazy people that fight everybody. So, I mean, I love that comment. And Beans goes further to say, now I watch the show with an open mind and enjoy it for the entertainment it brings. So that is it. Then at Kwa Bena Boateng, I guess that is, uh, Boateng is as Kenyan, 5252 says, yes. Is that time of the year again, and we leave for this kind of entertainment. Of course, the hypocrisy, the drama, the lies. I can't wait to defend my faith with my full chest. Trust you, just don't troll anyone, huh? Thank you, okay. So at Powerhouse of Positivity says, oh, wait a minute, I love the name of this channel, Powerhouse of Positivity. Positive doings will not cease in our lives. Okay, so the comment is, 
Trolling is always going to happen, that is for sure. People just have to be cautious of how they react to, to someone else's perspective. Yeah, that is so true. And, you know, people can troll you and you might decide to just ignore them, just leave them to their foolishness. I mean, try and develop thick skins for the housemates, for the viewers. I know when people, you know, when they, when they troll on your faith and you'll be like, I have to defend my faith. But at times you don't have to say anything. Just ignore them. Leave them alone. Let them carry on with their foolishness. Okay. So I have just two more comments. On the truth and wisdom corner, I love all the people that commented. They are really wise people. Okay, so at Chrissy893 says, it's hard not to get into your feelings about the show sometimes. And that is very, very true. I agree, Chrissy. But coming online and fighting people is just crazy. Well, it's more than crazy, I tell you, Chrissy. It's actually very silly. It's so silly. So Chrissy goes further to say, it's not that serious. The shouting and noise that I hear on some platforms is wild. I have to wonder if they are being real. Oh, yes, they are being real. That is who they really are. Okay, and the last comment for today on BB Ninja's Truth and Wisdom Corner is from MV Kid, and it says, I'm sorry to say, this season will be so toxic, I can feel it. Well, we pray not, but if it is so, we also are ready with our thick skins. All these comments, I mean, thank you so much, everybody that commented. All the comments were obtained from reputable BB Ninja YouTubers, and all that were created by me. So thank you guys for watching. More of this is coming. Until next time. Bye, guys.